100 power plants. Kinda. Uh, rounded up it was 100. We started with 96 and some people in the chat told me that I missed a few. And they sent me those on Discord. So we actually had over 100 in total when we started. Wait, what, is, this, is this a virus? So to narrow it down a little bit, we set up some criteria. No description, no test. So if the tweaker was, I don't know, too lazy or didn't know how to add a description and didn't want to spend the time and figure it out, I'm not going to spend the time testing it. And if there were several versions of the same power plan with different names only like in the folder, but not when you import it to Windows, I'm just going to skip it because there's no point. So the PC we are running this on is a 9800 X3D paired with a 4060 and default Windows 11 24H2 with only like the benchmarks apps installed. So we had Lady Simon, Catherine X, MSI Afterburner, uh, Discord and Brave, and Fortnite of course. All right, do you want to import all the power plans from the plans folder? Yes or no? Yes. Are we ready? Uh, this might crash the entire PC. It's gonna import 100 power plans now. <laughs> let's, let's see, F5. It worked. It's not gonna lie, I did not expect that to actually work. First goal, find the top 10 power plants using the Sky FPS test map. Now, this did not account for run variants, there's no aggregated runs, just one test per plan to find the top 10 power plants. Mm -hmm. Then taking those top 10 plants and then testing them further on the Hotel FPS test map with aggregated runs and a custom solo for like real world testing. So, the top 10 power plants. We had Lukefan, Ultimate Low Delay, Silo Free version 1, Lolly at Twixone, Optimal Power V4, the little Unix corn, never even heard of that one, GBYT, which is actually a bit some, but tweaked by another tweaker, and then ChatGPT version 0 0.1, the LMX power plant, and then Tensu. Skipping ahead here, at the bottom we find Ghost, so don't use that. So taking these top 10 and hiding them one after one based on the ones that had most FPS drops, we're gonna end up with Andamex. And as you just saw, the Andamex power plan was not the best of anything. Not the average, not the 1% or the 0.2% lows. But from these top 10, the Andamex one was the most stable. And obviously it depends a little bit on what you test, how you test and how you compare. But the Andamex power plan, in my opinion, and you know I can only talk from my own experience, is if not the best, one of the best power plans you can use. Last time I tested power plans, I had a little less data to analyze. We only really used the MSI overlay. So let's take a closer look. If we compare the AdamX power plan with the most expensive premium power plan from the Siri Tweaker, AdamX gets higher FPS on every metric. But it also looks like the Siri Premium one is more stable until we go in and analyze and check the stutters. Then Siri Premium had 4.2% and the AdamX had 3.3%. If you do your own benchmarking, make sure that you look at all the data and then compare. Then checking the hotel map with aggregated runs, AdamX comes out on top it is pretty close though and then checking the solo custom with a 360 rts fps cap the lmx one is the winner again but the only one that from these that were bad i would say was the windows default one all the other ones was pretty stable okay that's pretty much the the video just want to show you the bits one had 1.6 percent status that's crazy like yeah, it had one massive FPS drops, but if the Bitsumon could hold, like run this stable, that would have been crazy. So I'm gonna try and play some like actual games with the Bitsumon and upload some gameplay on the second, like the main channel. You can watch that. And if you wanna download some of the power plants here, I made a collection with the, the most commonly used ones that I've seen other people use, and the one I would recommend that you try. Download it, extract, and then just double click the power plant that you wanna test. I would recommend trying the LMX. Bitsum, Bitsium, all right, this is supposed to say Bitsum, <laughs> the Core, the Core V, and the Luke, well, so Luke at most, like the highest FPS, but it was kind of unstable, but I would recommend trying those and see how it works, and if you want to, you imported some of them, let's just try import Luke, press yes, then it should be imported, and if you want to like reset this, just double click the restore ones, click yes, and then you can update here and see that they are restored, so yeah, thank you for watching the video, and let me know which power plan you use. Alright.